have to start here in a moment. Let me drink more beers. Sorry. More beers. More beers. More beers. Yeah. Cheers to my lifelong friend, Mr. Mark, who we lost this year. A very bad year for a lot of people. This song I wrote, I met this lady on the bus on my commute every morning down the 36 to Colorado. And um, it was kind of uh, one of those things to where you don't know if you'll ever see her again kind of situation. But I was infatuated with her for like a month and then they're going to change my schedule. And so I wrote her a note like in high school. And um, we've been lovers ever since. Yes. Lonely redhead girl, someone left you in the rain. Stormy blue in that morning sky could not match your perfect face. Lay it by my side, no safer place to hide. By the light of the shame moon. Light of my room, turn my silver tongue into lead. And I think of them mournfully, sadly, not scornfully. Happy they're finally through. She is meant nothing to you. Don't you weep for her Now that there's sleep for her Under her favorite tree Patiently waiting for spring and Do not speak ill of her You may speak ill of me Sins of the living are not of the dead May she be judged by the mouths that she fed. Lay here by my side, no safer place to hide. By the light of the shame moon, light up our tomb. Turn my silver tongue into lead. Yeah. I really like that song. Thank you. Thank you. Jeremy Marcanti and I, I moved in across the street from him, and we were both fans of um, the David Lynch um, Blue Velvet series, or movie that series. And um, we worked together, he, uh, we would always just quote the movie all the time, you know, weird stuff like that. And um, I be literally became his neighbor, and I would leave weird notes, you don't want a love letter from me, kind of quote in the movie to him. And uh, he just it called me a good neighbor one day, and it stuck. And then it, it just kind of snowballed. And the irony was, I think Jeremy was always trying to obtain some kind of really good nickname, but nothing would stick. And all of a sudden, you know, our friends come to town, and they're like, neighbor. So, and that's been like a three-year phenomenon, so. It's strange. Now I'm, I've moved away and uh, from here, and people call me Paul, and I don't even respond to it anymore. So it's strange. That's a song, song, by the way. Yeah, that's a song. Tom Van and Oz.